Our worst fears seem to be coming to pass. Congress is debating a new bill, the Superhuman Registration Act. It would require all heroes to register with the government, whether they want to or not. Which would mean the politicians get to tell us who the bad guys are. We need to make sure this thing doesn't happen. To that end, we're heading down to Washington. I've been offered a chance to testify before a congressional subcommittee. And I'm going to rally the people down there. We need to get a grassroots resistance movement going before the SRA can gain any momentum. We want you to come along in case there's any trouble. We've got a Quinjet waiting to fly us down there. Let's go. We're coming up on DC, team. But the situation has radically changed during our flight, and not for the better. The city just came under attack by an unknown terrorist force. We're going to coordinate defense efforts with S.H.I.E.L.D. Buckle up, and be ready for anything. This is S.H.I.E.L.D. Lieutenant Farrell. We've got some of the Senators prepped for evac, but the zone's too hot to lift off. Eliminate the enemy forces in the area, so we can get those people out. Finally, some backup! Americano Vida Antes! Coming in! That's gonna leave a scar. Eliminate those terrorists! We need to get the Senators to safety! Who against us? Keep it up. I'll carve my initials in you. You got some good taste. This zone's secure. We'll get the choppers out. You should proceed down the hill. Head them off before they can hit us again. Approaching landing zone, ETA. Incoming, Sam. Joe Glass. We're hit. Dug out to the left, trying to put it out. Hang on.
down this time? Good call. I've got an unbreakable skeleton. Bet you don't. You like American? Yeah, I'll you stupid, vaguely foreign freaks! You ruined my vacation! And you! Dumb as nail shield clones! I saw what you did to those cherry blossoms back there! You think those things grow on trees? And you! You think it makes me less of a man if I came here for the cherry blossom festival, huh? You're laughing with your eyes! I can see it! Fine! Time for a little boss battle, suckers! I could take you out with three claws tied behind my back. Anyone mind if I gloat? should have sprung for the health meter enlargement I saw in that email. You're probably trying to clear out these terrorists, huh? Can I join the party? I'll join on any basis you want, as long as I get the keys to the Stark Tower executive washroom. Clear, Commander. I'll take things from here. Titanium Man seems to be behind all this. He just made off with some senators and took them underground. We'll cover the capital. You get down to the subway and pursue that tin-plated Russian and his pals. I'll keep you in mind. Now go! Come on! That away! The subway! When we see Titanium Man, let's try to get him to say Moose and Squirrel. If I were a supersized Russian bad guy, I'd head for some American chow. This way, to the food court. You think you're gonna get away with this on my watch? All right, the cavalry! Sure, why not? Thanks. That big guy dragged Senator Lieber and the others toward Union Station. Keep going this way. Thought you'd never ask. The clothes make the man, wouldn't you say? I'm so hot, and you're so not. Get 
working from home? <laughs> Say what you want about Titanium Man. At least the trains are still running on time. Da, Americans. Your precious representative is safe. For now. Do you have the courage to save him? Let us see. National Park King Garage. targets these days, yeah? Follow me, heroes, if you dare! Hey, what are you doing? We 
forget about those windbags and help me with this big metal dude. Senator Lever from New York State, good to meet you. You've done us a great service. You heroes are okay in my book. Maybe we should put this registration business on hold. No kidding, bub. You can't expect the X-Men to reveal their names to the... Say no more, Knucklehead. Not everyone fears and hates mutants. Well, best of luck trying to catch that maniac. Like our state motto says, Excelsior. Don't I know you from somewhere? You don't look like the voting type. Yeah, what up? Hey guys, I'll take these pencil pushers back to the Capitol. Give me a call if you want to hang out again. Americans, your deaths are waiting. Here, you are once again, a nation divided. Only this time, you will fall. With a little help, if necessary. Your democratic ideal will be your undoing, once your own people turn against you. Did you really think it would be that easy? La Svidania. If anybody asks, tell them Wolverine did this to you. Keep attacking. No Nithrop is cloaking. His cloaking field is down. Get him. Be honest. You knew you could. These mini sentry guns will give you something new to think about. your cowardly leaders, and you will become criminals! Running out. Oh. 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 
You... you think you've won, but you haven't. You'll soon see. You have already lost everything. And so, to answer your question, Mr. Senator, in spite of these recent events, I don't believe forcing superheroes to register with the government is the answer. This law would split the hero community right down the middle, with consequences I'm not sure any of us want to ponder. Hey, Mr. Stark! Mr. Stark! Was that really your best shot? Sneaking around doesn't become you, Steve. Maybe I'll need the practice. Maybe we all will. Don't be so melodramatic. This whole thing would affect you least of all. You're already deputized. You almost sound like you agree with them. This registration act would tear down everything we've done, destroy a century-old tradition of... I'm trying to save it, Steve. As much of it as I can, anyway. Don't you see where this is headed? All it's going to take is one more slip-up by anyone in a cape, and we'll be lucky if registration is the worst they do. They could just turn us all into criminals, hunt us all down. No, they won't, Tony. Not in my country. Now return to our special live episode of The New Warriors, coming to you straight from Stamford, Connecticut, where the Warriors have just been spotted by their super villain quarry. Looks like it's on. I've got cold heart, you guys. Hey, somebody snag Nitro. He's rabbiting. Don't worry, Speedball. I'm on it. On your feet, Nitro. And don't bother trying any of your stupid exploding tricks. Oh, baby, don't you even know? <laughs> You're playing with the big boys now. Reports now coming in from Stamford, Connecticut, indicate a massive explosion in a residential neighborhood. Just over 12 hours ago now, and preliminary casualties are said to be over 600. In Washington, rumblings on whether superhero reform should be brought to the Following table. Following last week's devastating explosion, Congress has rushed through passage of the Superhuman Registration Act, with the president expected to sign it. This is just completely insane, Hill. I won't do it. I'm sorry. Was it not clear I was giving you an order? You're asking me to arrest people who risk their lives for this country every day. No, I'm ordering you to obey the will of the American people, Captain. Either you help us bring them in, or we'll bring you in. Weapons down, gentlemen. Or I... Trank darts, now! Uh, take him down! Take him down! if you want to stay conscious. You idiot. We were trying to save lives. Of all the people to go underground, Captain America. Now every superhero who disagrees with the act suddenly has a leader. Maybe we should hold off until... That won't be necessary, Mr. President. Registration can go forward as planned. We'll take care of Captain America. With the passage of the Superhuman Registration Act earlier this week, superheroes around the country are being forced to choose a side. Do they register with the government to uphold the law or become part of an underground resistance movement? So far- Can you believe this is really going down? The act kicks in at midnight, but word is S.H.I.E.L.D.'s gonna be here sooner than that, taking signatures or prisoners. I wanna talk to Cage about it, but he's too busy arguing with Mr. Fantastic over there. Maybe you can break into their little powwow and get some sense out of them. Understand your skepticism, Luke, but you have to believe me. I've crunched the numbers, and we absolutely can't rebel against the government on this. If we do, the consequences... Can't be any worse than burning the Constitution. 
You're exaggerating. This is a temporary measure. Once things settle down... I ain't buying it, Reed. And I can't believe somebody as brainy as you would. Oh, hello. Good timing. Perhaps you can talk some sense into Mr. Cage here. He and Iron Fist seem determined to get arrested. He's the one who needs a reality check. But good luck getting anywhere with that. And so, in a worst-case scenario, we'd find ourselves in the equivalent of a super-powered civil war. Heroes so busy fighting each other, the criminals get a free pass. Exactly. That's where you and the Thunderbolts would come in, Melissa. We need you to help S.H.I.E.L.D. keep crime under control while we focus on... Oh, hello again. I'm glad to see you're not going off half-cocked like Luke, Danny, and Eli over there seem to be. We need cooler heads to prevail at a time like this. There's morality, and there's practicality. I may have personal issues with the act, but I also have hard evidence that if we rebel against it, the entire world's future will be imperiled. So, there's really only one sane choice here. Very good. When S.H.I.E.L.D. shows up, they'll have the paperwork ready for you. Just do what they say. My pleasure. Are you sure you can get us to Cap without leading them right to him? Got it covered. You just stick with me. But what about the rest? How can we convince... They're gonna have to make their own choice. Stark, Richards, and Songbird are obviously a lost cause. But maybe. Well, well. Speak of the devil. So you folks made up your minds yet? From what I hear, they ain't gonna give you much more time to sit on the fence. I ain't no government puppet. And I assume you feel the same way. There are worse things you could do than risk jail time to do the right thing. Any superhuman personnel listed as unregistered... Glad to hear it. We're gonna need some real heroes to get through this thing. Later. All superhumans, the Registration Act is in effect. You are now required to meet with Commander Hill and register your identity with S.H.I.E.L.D. I'm glad to see you're willing to meet with me on civil terms. Once you register, I'm sure we'll have a productive relationship. The paperwork is right here. Step up and sign, please. The law is in effect. Your time is up. So, what's it gonna be, heroes? Just sign up here and you'll be bona fide law enforcement agents. You're not looking to start trouble, are you?
smart move. I'm glad to see you're going through with registration. Congratulations on making the right choice, heroes. The only one you really had. I'll look forward to working with you. No! How could you? Cage told me I should have left with him and Iron Fist, but I didn't believe you'd do this! You damn traitors! Well, looks like your first assignment just walked through the door. Either convince that idiot to register, or take him down. Don't be a fool, Patriot. You don't want to be on the run. Shut up! There's nothing you can say to make me join you. This is for Cap! Stars and stripes, baby! Hello? No help bar! Anyone care? Wanna do rock, paper, scissors instead? An unfortunate introduction to government service for you. I'm sorry it had to come to that. Cage and Iron Fist refused to sign and escaped, and they're apparently not alone. I'm just glad you made the correct decision. Let's head back into the main area. We're gonna have our hands full, I expect, and I'm sure Tony will want to thank you personally once he gets back from Washington. I don't need to tell you that you've made the right choice. You're here, and that means you understand the reality of our situation. You know what we're up against, who we're up against. We simply can't restore the public's faith in us while Captain America and his recruits are still playing by the old rules. S.H.I.E.L.D. is going to use their expanded authority to keep supervillain activity in check. That leaves us with responsibility for dealing with the rogue heroes. We need to act decisively to end this fast. We have a few leads, and may be close to identifying one or more locations being used as hideouts by the Rebels. Come back here later. By then, we should have something more solid. I hate that it's come to this, but we have a job to do. We'll reconvene at the briefing station when you're ready.